Tonight on two, rap video repercussions. This video now has millions of views, and some of the people looking at it are Houston police officers. Those investigators say some of what they spotted are federal violations. That has led to arrest. Others are still wanted. Part of the video was shot in a community gathering place, Lakewood Park, right next to Hilliard Elementary. Phil Archer is live at the nearby police substation on Lay Road. He has a story only on two tonight. Phil? Yeah, and that park's only about a mile from this substation. Back in March, two rappers shooting a video in the park had a run-in with some of the officers. It led to a months-long investigation. The problem, their cast was made up of gang members using real guns, loaded guns, as props. Styling themselves as Maxo Cream and NFL Cartel Bow, the featured rappers chose Lakewood Park next to Hilliard Elementary School to shoot their video. They did it at about the same time school was letting out. Some of the kids actually got into the video. What also got in were about a dozen loaded guns, some of them stolen, that were being used for props. And the extras holding the guns, according to police, all documented street gang members. Some people driving by saw men with guns here on the basketball court and called police. When police showed up, some suspects with open warrants were arrested on the spot, but much of the cast ran, leaving behind the weapons and small amounts of drugs. Two months later, the video was released online, and it was a hit. It's gotten about two million views so far on YouTube. But it's also the tool police use to track down and identify everyone in the video who was holding a weapon. 20 have been charged with illegal possession of weapons, including rapper NFL Cartel Bo, also known as Warren Brown, a convicted felon. Brown was charged with illegally possessing two assault rifles and with threatening a police officer on the way to jail. He was released on bond in order to wear an ankle monitor. But police say he cut it off and disappeared. He's still on the run along with eight other suspects identified from the video. Four of them on probation or parole and one aspiring rapper Kenyon Tennessee shown holding a child is dead before he could be charged Tennessee was killed last month along with another man outside a West Side nightclub of the 20 facing state charges 11 have also been charged in federal court and police say some of them were already wanted for questioning in connection with other unrelated crimes reporting live in Northeast Houston I'm Phil Archer KPRC Channel 2 News